Good morning. Good morning, Winnie. And good morning, Chet. He's about to fall off the couch. Get your little legs up, bub. Good morning, you guys, and welcome to day eight of Vlogmas. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. Today, I think I'm going to do a little, like, self-care day, do things that I like doing, stuff like that. So it should be a pretty fun video. I'm about to leave my house once Mason gets back in from taking the dog out, and I'm going to go to the tanning bed because I have not been in a long time. I'm very pale right now. So I'm going to go tan, and then I think I'm going to run to the store and see if I can find, like, the, the glue-on acrylic nails. And then if I can't find those, I'm just going to paint my nails later. But, yeah, we're about to leave the house and go tan. I hope that the store, I'm, I'm going to the dollar store, and usually the one I have has, like, Little glue on acrylics, not a very wide selection, but a selection nonetheless. So I hope I can find some because I really want like fake nails, but I don't want to go to the salon and like get them done because I'm cheap and just finished buying Christmas presents, so I'm out of money. I don't know what it is, you guys, about a good tanning bed session, but I just feel so much better. There's a guy walking out now, now I look really weird. I don't know why I parked like right in front of the door. All right, y'all. I just got out of the dollar store and I got I got these nails. They're just little pink French tips. I almost got like a colored set, but they were long and these are medium length, but I don't think I can do long nails. I think I might need to like work up to that. Those were only $3 and then I had to get nail glue. This was only like $2, I think. But yeah, we're going to go home. What time is it? 11.40. I did in fact get a package today, but this, I'm not supposed to open this as a Christmas card, and if I open it, my mom will yell at me, because that's her, her joy, she says. This is from Ulta. I ordered all this stuff on Cyber Monday, but I'm getting it for Christmas, so I shouldn't open it, but I want to so bad. And then this, this is only big because it has a Christmas present for someone else in it. But I have one thing in here, so I'm going to open it. I got another tart shape tape because mine ran out. So here it is. I'm in the shade 27B Light to Medium Beige. The rest of the stuff is all Christmas, so I'm going to put the other package in this one. Oh, I just opened this so bad, you guys, because I know what's in it. Or I won't. I'll be good. I am downstairs in our little workout area. We just have like a couple th basic things. We have the treadmill, which is what I'm sitting on right now. We have a squat rack. Um, one of the like hexagon bars. I think it's a hexagon. The six-sided little thing. We have a bench press machine and then like free weights and stuff. We have a a punching bag but it's not hooked up for some reason it's laying on the ground over there i don't know we just have like a basic little gym down here i'm gonna walk on the treadmill i don't run and i'll probably watch some youtube i need to go grab a phone charger because i want to charge my phone while i watch and while i work out i'm wearing my marines shirt even though ian's not in the marines anymore i don't think i've ever talked about that before he was he's just in nrotc right now so he's in college so like he just had to do a bunch of paperwork to switch branches. It wasn't anything too deep. He just wanted to work on submarines, and the Marines doesn't have submarines. So we switched to the Navy. So now he is in the Navy. I don't think I've ever talked about him being in the military at all on my channel. I could be very wrong on that, though. I'm not really sure, but yeah. I just had this from when he was in the Marines, and now he's in the Navy. And I have no Navy stuff, so I need to get some. I don't know why I started talking about my shirt. Just wanted to clear that up, I guess. 
I did legs yesterday, so I might do a little bit of arms today. We'll see what I come up with. With my workouts, I just kind of make them up as I go. So honestly, I don't even know what I'm going to do. I did 30 minutes at a 7.5 incline out of 10, so like 75% incline. Um, the speed was 3 miles per hour. I am sweating really bad. I think I'm going to get to lifting. I'm going to record like one set of everything that I end up doing just to show you guys. I just finished my workout. I'm heading back up the stairs. I'm gonna make some lunch. I am starving. I don't know what I'm gonna make yet, but I'll let you guys know. So I made some beef flavored rice for lunch and I just have my water. I'm working on my final project for one of my classes. Basically the lighting's really bad on them and I'm sorry, but um, I'm basically making a four week workout program for someone. So I finished my lunch and I worked on my project for a little bit. Mason is leaving to take Winnie on a walk so they will be gone like an hour maybe. I made another iced coffee and I think I'm gonna take a nice relaxing shower. I think I'm gonna purple shampoo my hair because last time I did it it didn't really turn gray. Like it made my hair icy but I like my hair gray so we're gonna put more in. And then I think I'm going to do a hair mask just because purple shampoo is super drying and I do want my hair to still be soft. Um, I'm going to show you guys the stuff I use in the shower, I think. Like my purple shampoo and my hair mask because they are both so freaking good. Um, it's about 1 or 2. I really can't remember what time it is and my phone's in the other room. So I'm going to shower now so that my hair will be dry. Because I have to get up in the morning. I work in the morning. And blow drying your hair in the morning and styling it is a lot. So I think I'm going to blow dry it and style it today. Just so that I can get a little bit more sleep in the morning. So we are going to go shower. And then I'm going to show you guys my really good purple shampoo. Oh my goodness you guys. I'm obsessed with this stuff. I posted to my Instagram story like a reel from Hair by Chrissy who did... She tested different purple shampoos and like showed their results and stuff. And the one that I use, in my opinion, had the best results. It was like the most purple slash grayish one. And it is the Fanola No Yellow Purple Shampoo. And this stuff is seriously so freaking good. And this entire big 32 ounce bottle, 33.8 ounce bottle was like $11 on Amazon. I'm not even kidding. And then, I don't know where my hair mask is. I think it's down here. Yep. This is the hair mask I use and it is on the pricier side. I can't remember exactly how much it is, but this brand in general is a little more expensive, but it is amazing. And I've been using this brand for years. I think since like middle school because my friend Grace used it in her hair and I could smell her hair and I was like, what is that? And she said, this brand Moroccan oil is the shampoo and conditioner and all the products she uses was Moroccan oil. And I was like, I'm gonna have to start using that. And I've been using it ever since. It is seriously amazing. But this hair mask, you just keep it on your hair for like five minutes. If it's gonna, I don't know if it'll focus on it. There we go. It's like a intense hydrating mask. I think they have different masks. They also have like color ones. So like, if like the equivalent of a purple shampoo they have like a purple hair mask i've never tried those so i don't know how well those are but the hydrating one is so good so i'm gonna hop in the shower it might take me a while since i am gonna purple shampoo and do the mask in the same shower but i just want to relax and i'm gonna listen to some worship music in there we are gonna get some nails on i got these brand they're the kiss Perfect French nails, and I got the pink ones. I already opened them, and then this is the Kiss Maximum Speed Nail Glue because I am impatient. So I'm gonna open these and see what size needs to go on each finger. I haven't worn these kinds of like fake nails in like since early high school, so maybe when I was a freshman or sophomore. That's a long time. 
All right, you guys, so I got these bad boys glued on and they're actually really pretty. Um, look at my ring. My promise ring is so beautiful, you guys. I cannot. Anyways, back to my nails. Um, they are really long and I feel like I can't do anything with them. So I don't know how long they're going to last on my fingers. I feel like I just need to like get used to them and stuff. But like I'm struggling like typing on my phone. <laughs> they are really beautiful and I really like them. They're three dollars, a dollar general. So if you're balling on a budget like me, but want your nails done, go to Dollar General. They had my Dollar General had probably like 15 different kinds. Like there was a ton. A lot of them were very like colorful, and I'm not into colorful nails. I like this and like nudes, pinks, that sort of thing. Um, I was originally going to look for like the ombre French kind of, they're kind of French, but the ombre ones and they didn't have those there. So I just got regular French, but they're super pretty and I would highly recommend them. I just, they're so long and these are the medium length too. Like I almost got long ones. They were pink and they were so pretty, but I was like, I don't know if I can handle the long nails and I can barely handle medium. So it's a good thing I got these and not the other ones. I am slowly but surely adjusting to the nails. I'm getting better at like typing with them now. I have to like go with the side of my finger, which feels super weird. I'm getting used to it. And I've edited the video up until this point with the nails. So I think they'll stay on a little bit. I'm actually really liking them now. They're so pretty. I just love French tip nails. They just look so classy and I just really love them a lot. The real trial is going to be at work tomorrow to see if I can like do all my work stuff with these nails because that might be where the issue lies is can I do my job or not. But um, I think I'm just going to end the vlog right here. Thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate all of you so, so much. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching. Leave a comment down below and subscribe to my channel. And then make sure you hit the notification bell so that you will know when I upload my next video.